got first place in the billboard was 13 years ago. Oh wow, it's a really, really huge band. I would risk saying that BTS is bigger from BTS, 100%. 안녕하세요. 전 영국에서 on air 로 온다. 나 오징어 됐어요. Did I watch my own video? Yeah. I never watch YouTube, but I must admit I do watch all my videos. But that video, guys, I've lost weight. Okay, can you stop talking about my pesai? Please don't write comments about my pesai. When I saw that, I was like, oh, 나 다이어트 해야겠다. 그래서 나 살이 많이 빠졌거든. 아 키운데. No, the thing is the comment. Negative comment. Comment 없었는데 그냥 아 pesai 너무 귀여워. 이렇게 쓰는데 나 그냥. The last video came out. They were like, "Oh, Emily, you're so pretty. You're so beautiful. You're so pretty. You're so beautiful. 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 I actually need to read about the song because I like I'm trying to understand why they talk about the universe. Are they talking about unity and that kind of thing? To be fair, there's been a lot of division lately. Ooh, look at him flirting! That's the key point of the whole music video. Is someone flirting. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. Go, sir. Sorry, I haven't watched the music video, so I'm, guys, I'm like I'm actually like trying to understand the whole thing. Maybe he is flirting with BTS. He's saying to them, you are my universe. And then BTS is being like, chop on my hand. <laughs> Me shipping Coldplay and BTS. They look good together, I'm sorry. It's not my favorite, to be honest. I think they could have made it, honestly, if they just, I don't know, it's just too fictitious. I don't know why I would have thought. But then, I don't know, because our last Coldplay music was really like real and just putting, you know, arts in the street. I honestly, I need to know more about the song and why they decided to make it all alien and make it look like a, like a game. But pretty colors. The song is nice. Yeah, you got first place in there. Got first place in the billboard was 13 years ago. Oh, wow. Hapta Coldplay, 14 years ago. Billboard 1 year. I'm here, come on. That's the thing. Coldplay is a really, really huge band. I would risk saying that BTS is bigger, fan number wise. Especially, like, you know, the, the actual fans that are really dedicated wise. Honestly, it's just great. But the thing is, Coldplay has a lot of more popularity with older people. And them collabing with BTS will actually, I think, allow older people to respect BTS more. Because I don't think a lot of people still respect them as much as they should be respected and yeah absolutely because the ones who are voting who are watching streaming are young people and what i'm so strictly about fan base is young people that would be like streaming making sure that they're doing well but it's just also a good song so that's probably also why because they like koreans and i think coldplay knows that korea deserves more respect as artists and deserves more to be shown in the west more so i think they really thought about that and this is the shortest record for the beatles to rank first in a year and a month bts has unquestionably fame and it's just nobody's competing with them right now they, they don't have any competition and the thing is every single song they release becomes top one or top two or top ten you know yeah, BTS is just ruling the world right now Coldplay did benefit from BTS a hundred percent and the US is still really reluctant for some stupid reason to allow a lot of like Korean artists to make it abroad it just seems like they want to put this wall and nobody wants that wall there everybody's like why is this why is this wall here and then Coldplay is like we don't care about this wall we're gonna bring them over. I think now even more and more foreign artists are gonna try to start collaborating with Korean artists as they should. It had been in my mind for a while that I was a great driver but I was driving around. So when he was thinking about BTS and then my universe came out guys what do you think that that means? So I wanted to hand given to be communicating with BTS and then went to Korea and then uh, Honestly, that's so mad. Felt like really cool to that's have so cool. two bands. There's a real 
bandiness to them. You know, they're really, as far as I can tell, really. Now that makes more sense. Aww, he's in love. I'm just happy. It's about time. I'm just really happy that it actually happened. Because it's, you know, it's about time that this kind of thing happens. I'm sorry, but you know, they've deserved this for a long time by now. Become huge as, like, some of the most successful artists on planet Earth. And, and it's just kind of like Chris Martin loves music. He's an artist, he's living for music, but then he also appreciates the people. And so seeing these two very, because they're very different, like Coldplay and BTS are actually really, really different, but then they came together and they're actually working together and he really appreciates them as people as well. Not just as like pretty boys who, who are tall and handsome, but also who are actual friends. He actually felt good. He said, he was like, yeah, he was happy there. And I'm really happy and I really hope that they do, they do spread more of this positive energy because right now after, with Corona and everything, I think Things have been really difficult for a lot of people, so it's good to see this. Today we talked about Coldplay and it reaching Billboard Top 1 in the one hot 100s. If you liked the video, please like, subscribe, and yeah, see you next time, later. <laughs>